Hey everyone, so uh, this video is probably something that you were all expecting. Um, if you saw my last video, I kind of went on a rant uh, regarding the movie Spider-Man No Way Home and all of the rumors that have been associated with the film. Um, and finally, the, the moment everyone has been waiting for, the trailer just dropped. Um, not just dropped, but it was a couple days ago by the time I'm filming this video. And, uh, I wanted to give my quick thoughts on it. This video is probably not going to be too long. I don't have much to say. So what did I think of the trailer? Um, I thought it was pretty good. I mean, let's be honest, it was basically what we were expecting it to be. Um, you know, his identity is revealed, it's caused a lot of problems, everybody knows who he is, obviously. He then goes to Doctor Strange to see if he can fix it, and Doctor Strange tries something, and then it gets fucked up, and then the multiverse opens. What just happened? We see a glimpse of Electro, and you know, lightning bolts everywhere. We also see a pumpkin bomb and Willem Dafoe's laugh as the Green Goblin. <laughs> we don't actually see him, but we see the, just the pumpkin bomb and we hear the laugh. And I, 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 I'll be honest, I freaked out when I, when I saw the pumpkin bomb. That was probably like my favorite part about the trailer personally. I know everybody's been talking about Doc Ock at the end, you know, hello Peter. And that moment is great too. Um, and yeah, it was really exciting to, to you know, see uh, Alfred Molini as, as Doc Ock again. Be careful what you wish for, Parker. Hello, Peter. Um, even though I don't completely agree with him coming back, I mean, I think his death in Spider-Man 2 was a good way to end his character. I mean, and now he's just back and he's, you know, a villain again. That's kind of stupid. Um, but hey, like either way, I, I'm, like I said, I'm excited. It's exciting to see these villains again. Um, even if, you know, they kind of, you know, they're kind of fucking up their character arc. <laughs> um, and I think that's going to be the, probably the biggest one, or one of the biggest problems with this film is that with some of these villains that they're bringing back, most of them died. Um, and they're not really villains anymore by the time they died. But yeah, those three villains we saw in the trailer. People are also saying that you can see the lizard. Um, it's really hard to tell. It's like a very quick shot and you can't really tell that something's like lunging at Peter and you don't really know what it is, and people are saying it's the lizard. Some people are even saying it's Tom Hardy's Venom. I... I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't jump to conclusions yet. I mean, we don't know if it's the lizard, we don't know if it's Venom, you know. It's so hard to tell, and people are also saying that when you can see Electro, you can also see Sandman. I personally don't really know. <laughs> I don't really see it. But, mainly live on. but um... Again, like, I wouldn't say, I wouldn't jump to conclusions and say the Lizard and Sandman are in this movie. In fact, I saw a video where it was saying, like, all five Spider-Man villains in Spider-Man No Way Home, and it showed them all in the trailer, you know, you know, they showed the Pumpkin Bomb, they showed Doc Ock, they showed Electro, and then they said it. there's Sandman and Lizard. It's like, I don't think, we, we have no idea, it's so hard to tell, I, I don't think we should jump to conclusions. Um, but yeah, um, Willem Dafoe as Green Goblin basically confirmed to be in this movie. I think that's really, it's, it's going to be really cool to see him again, but again, he died. So I real I'm really curious to see what, what they're going to do, like how, how they're going to explain all this. Um, and, uh... <laughs> I'm honestly pretty, you know, I'm pretty skeptical, even though I'm also excited. And honestly, seeing the pumpkin bomb and hearing the Green Goblin laugh, um, that's, that is actually one rumor that's true. 
um, you know, that wasn't confirmed. Willem Dafoe was just a rumor, but now it's pretty much confirmed. And it actually has made me think that it's probably more likely that Toby and Andrew are going to be in the film. Um, I'm not saying I'm 100% sure that they're going to be in the film, but I think it is more likely now that we know that the Green Goblin is going to be in the film. I've heard people say that Doc Ock, when he says hello, Peter, at the end, he's actually talking to Toby's Spider-Man. Um, again, we I don't know. We, we don't know. Um, but... You know, that's just what people are speculating. But yeah, um, basically, you know, my whole point is I pretty much have have a love-hate relationship with this movie. It hasn't even come out yet, you know, but I'm excited for it, and I'm excited to see all these characters returning. Um, but at the same time, I'm extremely skeptical, and I really, I, I still don't think this movie is going to be good. So yeah, that's basically all I had to say. I actually am going to be moving soon, so don't expect, like, a bunch of videos soon. I have some ideas of videos I would like to make, um, but I'm not sure if I'm actually going to do it, and I don't know when they're going to come out. See you guys in the next video, and have a good night.